fight hello everyone and welcome to a new video I'm here today in uh, an Indian restaurant uh, this restaurant is located in Raleigh North Carolina and it's called Taj Mahal uh, it's located in uh, off of uh, Fawcett News Road so I'm here today to try uh, good curry I'm looking for this option uh, in a lot of different Indian restaurants so I'm gonna try it here and see how it tastes so I just took my order um, it's including uh, goat curry uh, medium spicy and uh, I also have um, naan with garlic and samosa yeah so it's gonna be uh, really exciting to try goat curry from an Indian restaurant I'm not sure if they have a different section um, than this uh, but it seems to be uh, a little bit small but uh, they may have uh, different sections uh, inside the restaurant um, so far the restaurant cleanliness is, uh, is just amazing uh, so clean uh, the staff is very friendly and, um, it's a uh, time right now is about 8 20 and I think they will close about um, about uh, 9 30 so maybe hour and 10 minutes um, today is Friday and, uh, uh, yeah um, uh, not a lot of people eating outside today <laughs> uh, so yeah I will uh, uh, might be I, I may come back again to this restaurant to film uh, different uh, menu item uh, but uh, so far um, I tried good curry in different locations. Uh, they always amazing, amazing. So this is a new location. I'm going to try good curry today. Just received uh, the good curry. Look at that. This entire bowl is full of good curry with lots of meat, or with lots of good meat, uh, lots of. A lot of chunk of goat meat and look at look at that sauce. Gonna try. Mm. Wow, you can taste definitely the goat flavor. Goat meat is so flavorful. I also have uh, rice. I believe that is best rice. Yes, I'm gonna use that rice. And I, I got the uh, garlic naan bread. Try some of that naan. Mm. That is so delicious. This is the good curry. into the rice the meat on it This is the <clears throat> going to be the first bite uh, goat curry sauce with rice. Mm. Very very tasty. Oh, wow, the, the 
the uh, salt, the uh, spices, the texture of the sauce mixed with the rice. It's yeah, it's a bit uh, spicy, but not too much. Uh, not too much spicy. Try some of that good curry meat. Wow, that is very tasty. There's some more in it. Unbelievable flavor. I mean, the way it cooks is just uh, it, it is cooked by a professional. If I try to cook it this way, I will never be, I will never be able to be successful in cooking it like that. This is super tasty. Look at that. Look at that. Mix it with that rice. Just eat. Mm. Goat meat, by the way, is very famous in India. So many parts of India they cook uh, goat meat, they use goat meat for cooking. Here in the US, not a lot of people, it's not a, not a lot of fan of goat meat here in the US, but uh, trust me, it is very healthy. It has less cholesterol less fat and it's more lean uh, texture is more uh, a little bit softer than the lamb but i i so far enjoy this <laughs> this is super delicious mm. so tasty Put more of that good thing. This is a traditional Indian bowl. Uh, I went to an Indian restaurant before. They serve in about the same type of bowl uh, for good cake or any kind of cake. Look at that meat, that's unbelievable. Uh, they gave me uh, two types of sauce, I think this is spicy sauce, so I'm gonna is that chili, green chili sauce? I'm gonna add power some. I believe 100% is gonna be more spicier. Mm. Wow. <laughs> that green chili sauce is just taking it to a different level. So tasty. But to be honest, this will, this amount of goat curry will feed approximately two people. Big chunk of goat curry. Hmm. It is so soft and tender. You don't need a lot of chewing. Cooked to perfection. But I 
believe it is a type of uh, slow cooking for us to get to that level. But adding that that green chili sauce is just a game changer. Unbelievably tasty. It's almost that green chili. There's a lot of you can see here so much chunk of meat, goat meat. But uh, for me, I like. I like goat meat more than lamb meat. It doesn't have a lot of uh, um, fat and it's soft and tender. Unbelievable mm. mm. If you haven't tried good curry or if you haven't tried goat meat, this you can eat it with the Indian goat curry. That's the best option. You can eat goat meat. Go to an Indian restaurant and uh, get you a goat curry. And eat it with the rice. I don't forget about the chili sauce. It's so tender, it just melts in your mouth. Mm. You can tell from the bone of uh, the goat, this is kind of, of a, uh, a young uh, goat uh, used for this uh, meal. Even the rice, uh, when it, it kind of absorbs that good curry sauce uh, evenly. I mean, every single piece of rice here is coated 100% with good curry. Not like any, uh, not like some other uh, types of rice. Uh, even if you power. That is delicious. Uh, curry, curry sauce in India is a very authentic recipe made almost in every part of India. But uh, I think uh, different parts of India cook it uh, 
slightly different depending on what type of spices they use like the southern southern cuisine in India may be maybe slightly different uh, I'm not sure I'm just um, uh, according to what um, uh, some of my friends told me uh, there are so many culture in India you can possibly walk in one street the next street to speak a different language it's just a mixed culture in one country and different streets so uh, if, I'm guessing if the language is different in between one corner to another corner that kind of makes sense you're gonna have a difference in cuisine as well <laughs> so tender, so tender. Not so much fat on it. Very, very lean. And don't forget about that. That green chili sauce is just record breaking. Ah. <laughs> it, it changed it changed the flavor completely to more uh, tastier. And it's look like a in in-house made so they uh, possibly didn't buy from different place but they possibly made this in-house but yeah it's a different game changer So like I told you, very fast and quickly absorb that sauce and distribute it evenly. Uh, all you have to do is just scoop it and eat it. I didn't get it. I did not get a chance to eat it with the naan, but <laughs> the rice I was so, so uh, very much satisfied with the combination between the rice and the sauce. So I decided to continue. Uh, there is nothing left over for trying to carry with the naan. That's my last piece of meat. I think I should go to India, definitely. I need to go to India uh, to try more of their food. It's one of the best cuisine in the world.
looks like I finished all my good curry. What a fantastic experience. I really don't have any room to try the, uh, the non bread for the samosa and very satisfied. Who's focusing 100% on the bread? Careful. This is the number bread. Uh, that's the non bread. Uh, I went for the garlic option. Uh, I did not get a chance to really enjoy eating it with the goat curry because I just love the goat curry with the rice. It went perfect. That combination went perfect. So I'm just gonna try. Mm. Very garlicky, you can definitely taste the uh, garlic and there are some spices in the top and buttery as well, as well as the uh, sauce. Wow, that is <clears throat> after eating that heavy curry goat, goat, after eating that heavy goat curry, uh, water is the best drink you can drink after a heavy meal uh, and me personally I don't go with the soda or in some cases I do I forget but uh, water is always the best drink for a heavy meal like this uh, got curry with rice heavy heavy sauce Alright, the total for today came around uh, uh, $32, $32, uh, $32. So, uh, very reasonable price for the amount of food you get. And uh, really, the quality of the food is seriously good. Thank you so much. Alright, guys, I hope you enjoyed watching today's video about uh, Taj Mahal, Indian cuisine, Indian restaurant and uh, I hope you enjoyed watching me eating the Indian goat curry. I really enjoyed uh, eating tonight the Indian goat curry with the rice. Uh, it was uh, Please don't forget to like and subscribe and see you again in the next video. Bye!